tropical forests. So um, across the tropics, those are forests that receive uh, low rainfall that is distributed with a wet season that can alternate with a dry season. I think making art definitely makes you a better biologist, and that's because you're looking at the organism. Um, as scientists, we spend our lives immersed in spreadsheets and R code and numbers, but I think when you're actually drawing an organism, when you're looking at it, you're honing your skills of observation in a way that just poring over spreadsheets or R code or data can't. We are enmeshed, we're, we're enveloped in a digital world. By actually drawing something with your own hand on a piece of paper, um, it, it, it brings you out of that. Um, and I think it allows you to be more present, to focus on what you're drawing um, in a way that uh, digital photography doesn't. So what I've learned through this process of um, trying to do art on my own is that cool biology is everywhere. Um, I've I've drawn dead insects that I found in my backyard. I've, um, I've been watching the trees in my yard as they're budding um, and trying to capture that process. And so I think in that way, um, being, you know, being attuned to nature has helped me appreciate more the, uh, the biology, the ecology that I see everywhere. In my kitchen, in my backyard, in my study sites, um, in all of these uh, different countries across the tropics. Thank you.